Here we go with anime news. Okay, real quick. Uh, I recently found... Oh yeah, not much happened this week. I recently found a guy who does trailers real well for animes. His name is Rox Flows. R-O-X flows except with a z yeah, they're amazing they have he has clanted ones and they are better than anything i've ever seen probably better than the m makers would make uh also friday's video might be me making a dongo cake t tutorial type thing look out for that tell me if you want that um starting with uh avatar the last airbender who knew that he that they had a comic I didn't. Apparently, it's very good, so if you're an Avatar fan like me, hurry up and check it out. Uh, it Again, it, it uh, picks up where this animated series left off, and once again, it sounds like it's uh, delivering more than it's supposed to. Crunchyroll uh, added up a bunch of pictures of cool lunchboxes of anime characters, or lunch, you know, brown paper bags. People, they drew a bunch of awesome anime characters all over it. We got, like, Totoro, we got more Totoro, Totoro Honda, etc., etc. Really cool done things, ones with a Pikachu. Uh, next, if you like Black Rock Shooter, and I don't know why you would, it's, in my opinion, not very good, but if you like it, um... It's been, uh, the Blu-ray and DVD box set includes a new figurine. Uh, it's of... What? Okay, it doesn't actually say who it's of. I guess the picture is supposed to indicate who the heck it's actually supposed to be. I don't like it. I watched one episode and stopped watching it. Can't tell you who that is. Um, the next Amnesia game, if you guys have ever played Amnesia The Dark Descent, might take place in China. I, I find that kind of weird, but okay. I never really liked Amnesia because it was not scary whatsoever for me. I was a big fan of Doom 3 and played it until I stopped getting scared of things. <laughs> I'm not joking. Um, next, if you are an Atlas fan like me, if you uh, tried to ever buy Radiant Historia after wearing a print, you would lol at the humongous amount of... Uh, money it would cost. They're re-releasing it, or they're they're making more copies. I don't know if that's considered re-releasing it. Uh, Thirty-five bucks a pop, not bad. Thankfully, I didn't buy it when it was ridiculously priced. If you want the game, go buy it. I'm pretty sure it is actually amazingly good, which is why a lot of people were buying it for the ridiculously high price. Uh, next, Crunchyroll has, or Crunchyroll users, I should say, uh, have got a poll of the most boring. Uh, winter 2012 anime, so stay away from <coughs> Familiar Zero F, Anonatsu de Matu, Nai, Goku Jyo, Car Cardboard Battle Chronicles, Nisei Monogatari, Bodacious Space Pirates, Senki Zesho Simophir, no, Simphogear, I've never heard of that one, Tante Opera Milky Homes, with an L, and number one at the most boring is Kill Me Baby. I, I guess they want you to kill yourself if you watch that or something. I don't know the point. Um, uh, if you're a Kingdom Hearts fan, I'm not a big Kingdom Hearts fan ever since the first one. Ever since the second one, I should say. I like the first one, the second one. Just kind of just kept it at one game, but I have people who love Kingdom Hearts. Uh, the box art has been revealed. If you haven't heard of Kingdom Hearts 3D, it'll be for the DS. It's a new game. Go check that out. Um, next, uh, a lot of different Japanese anime fans were asked in a poll, and Crunchyroll has put together a giant list of what, uh, Japanese anime fans really want to watch, and how they decide on watch what to watch for anime, and I originally clicked on this because the, uh, title was, How Important Is Moe Really? And... Uh, it's only number 10, which I thought I was going to laugh at being, at being number 1. But no, story is 1, characters are 2, voice actors are 3, design is 4, themes, background music are 5, goes all the way down to 29. I will let you guys read all that if you want it. Uh, next, South Korea considers to uh, limit its kids' gaming time, and I really don't like that. I really don't like that. And already in South Korea, kids 16 and under cannot play any online games, including Xbox Live. But that only starts this month. And I really don't like that. Uh, but that's only that's only between uh, uh, it's midnight and 6 a.m. But still, I hate that. Um, uh, and lastly, uh, we have the top 30 anime 
uh, openings and endings of 2012. Uh, Steins Gate's opening is normally number two. I really, really don't agree. I think it should be number one. I think Crunchyroll agrees with me because the picture for this is, of course, the Steins Gate opening, but who knows? That could just because they had Cr Steins Gate in, well, it's was off at least a week ago. They had some kind of legal problems with it or something. I don't know what's going on with that. I haven't checked it since, but it was off Crunchyroll, which really made me mad. Thankfully, I had it all downloaded, wink, wink. But uh, number one is the th C3 first opening. Number three is Anohana ending. And I'll just let you read the rest. There's a total of 30. Yeah, I already said top 30. And that more or less ends it. There could be something else that comes out tonight, later. We'll see. Uh, once again, should I make a Dongo Cake uh, video? Should I even make a Dongo Cake? Who knows? It'll probably be ate, eaten later by me and my friends. So... Tell me that. It'll probably be a pink dongo with the cheeks, you know, the Nagisa like one. Don't forget to go look at uh, the anime trailers. They are awesome. I think there's only seven out right now, but they are they are almost m more than professional. I, I really do think that Sentai and Ki couldn't have made anything better, especially for after stories. And I especially like his he or she used the subs. <laughs> so have fun with that. Hope you like it, and I hope I didn't breathe into my mic too much, because I know my mic goes, and uh, that probably killed your ears. I'm probably going to take that part out. Anyway, bye.